What's going on guys? Boy Maximum RPM coming at you with another video today and in this video we are going to be doing a beat -em on video uh, with Bottlemon, uh, the new adaptation of beat -em on, uh, starting to hit the stores. I figured we'll do a beat -em on episode starting with uh, Battle beat -em on, then moving up to Crossfight, then to Fire Blast. We will move our way up the chain, starting out with good old stock beat -em on So the goal of this video is to get all of the blocks out of the tower without losing any marbles, or with losing as few marbles as possible. So we're going to see how that goes here today. All right. It's off to a great start. Ooh. As long as you hold it perfectly still, your last shot will be consistent to the one that you previously fired. So we've lost one marble. We are two lanes down. Oh god, I hate it when this happens. I also added a magazine just so I'm not spending all day reloading. Ah, we got both. Nice. This is one test that I really love doing. I am really looking forward to getting Bottleman. Bottleman, however you want to pronounce it. Plus, I have some plans for Battle Beatmon. Oh, come on. Now, this did originally have a power buckle, uh, but it broke, or not a power buckle, but like a uh, core power advancement. I don't know what the proper terminology is other than power buckle or power wings. Mine broke for my uh, Knight Cavalry. And these stupid bricks are stuck so we'll just push them back even that way I'm not just sitting here for a half hour getting nowhere let's see if we can get this in only two shots oh come on come on don't even get in my way There we go. We have one row left for marbles. Let's see how it goes. Man, a power boost would be nice. I really wish I could find a... Uh, Phoenix. It'd be nice if I could find a Helio Breaker. Oh, come on. There we go. We only lost one marble. Now on to the next beat em on. Alright, now we have Excel Drossian, which has much more power and it has a drive core. Expect to lose a couple marbles this time. Here we go. See, there's that drive core. There's a piece of rubber in the core that makes the marble spin forward, giving it more power and a second hit. So, we're hitting so hard. Now yeah, she sent that one over the top. I'm trying to hit in between so I don't. Yes! I love Excel Drossian. Excel is probably one of my favorite cores uh, next to Spike. 
the power that this thing cranks out. I think Force uh, has more power from Force Dragon. Um. Ah, and there's our first Marvel loss. I really like the Force Core. Wish I could have gotten it, but no dice. We actually got two out that time. That one went around. Let's see if we can knock both of these out. Oh, yes, way over here. All right, we are making very good progress with this. Don't speak too soon. That. I am using uh, the glass marbles which do have a much better drive than a plastic marble, unless you are using a uh, drive marble. This thing's just blowing them right off the uh, lid. Those are really good drive shots. And there we have it. Tied. All right, and our final beat em on of the day is an absolute monstrosity that I made called King Mortar. This has the Drazeros 2 arm parts, the Gatling Death Shell uh, core, and the uh, hold parts from Gunlock Wolg. Yes, that is where my Beyblade gets his name from, but that's where the similarities end. It's got the wide receiver magazine, emblem charge, Drazeros 2 head as well, and drift jacker legs. And he packs a punch. But as you can see, he's not very accurate. So here's his major problem. His core is damaged. You can actually see, yeah, it's not going to focus, but you can still see that there is a crack in the core, so his power is very inconsistent, but let's do an emblem, emblem charge. That was five emblem charges. Um, So his power is wildly inconsistent uh some shots are just like where did all that power come from and then others are just like wow that was crap like right there holy crap <laughs> that sent the brick about four feet back this is where his emblem charge is typically stronger is when his arms are in this mode The only way I could have made this thing any more powerful is if I had the spike or force core. And at that point, I, I shouldn't be allowed to use these things. We haven't lost one yet, but it's one of the hardest configurations because we've got the center with no way of protecting ourselves from losing it. So let's go for that first. Oh, we almost lost one there. Hmm. Ah. Oh, God. Here's where his huge flaw comes in, and that is that he is wildly inaccurate and inconsistent. Some shots have really good power and go kind of where you aim. And then there are ones that are like, yeah, that was a Hail Mary. That did nothing. It's like a haymaker. If it delivers, it delivers. But if it misses, you kind of just screwed yourself. All right, emblem charge for this. And King Mortar, probably the least likely beat him on to do this. 
does it. All right, guys, that's about it. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on the bell notifications so you get all my videos because I upload daily. And as always, hope this video makes your day just a little bit better. Live life to the max and stay awesome.